Hi guys, I'm back. So I told you guys that I'd have two um, unboxing videos. Here's my second unboxing video. You guys have seen this on Instagram. I posted a picture of myself wearing them a few times and you guys went crazy. Um, and I'm talking about the Versace shoes that I got and um, yeah, let's just Let's just start. Let me show them. So I got these for myself um, as a birthday present. The bag that I showed you was from my family, from from my family to me. And then I decided that I should spoil myself a little bit, and I got myself some shoes. Now, the bag is beautiful. You see this bag? Look at that. It was pretty nice. Um, and once again, we went to Yorkdale Mall. There's a Versace store in Yorkdale that we went to. And um, there was this one guy that we dealt with. I'm not sure his name, I think. Ah, I forgot his name. But he was super, super nice. We actually spoke to him a couple of times before finally buying the bag, uh, a couple of days before finally going back in and buying the shoes. And he was really nice and helpful. So my box is already kind of dirty. It's fine. Um, it just comes in this white box, just like a white shoe box, nothing special except for the logo that's on the top. And then when you open it, they um, are wrapped, it's wrapped in tissue paper. And then once you open that, your shoes are wrapped in a duffel bag. It's a white duffel bag and it has the white first like the sign and it has like the little strings on them and then when you open this out come your shoes so I've worn these out already but because they're so fresh and so new I want to keep them packaged like this always that I know that's not gonna last all the time but that's what your shoe looks like I'll take out the other one for you in a bit so let me first show you guys the shoe that's what's the bottom uh, that's what the bottom looks like I'm gonna tease you guys a little bit and then oh no um here's what the side looks like it is um, a metallic gold with a uh, black outlining like the metallic gold and black outlining and of course we have the Medusa head um, the Medusa head, the thing that I really liked about this was that if you guys have went into a Versace store, you'll know that the Medusa heads are usually a very yellow gold. Um, this one, I forgot what name he said that is called, but it's kind of more, it's more of a muted gold, so you can actually wear it with both gold and silver uh, jewelry, so it won't, it won't clash as much. And same with the gold that's being used on the shoe itself, it's not a yellow gold, it's, uh, it's more muted, so it, um, yeah, you can use it with both silver and gold. Um, the inside it just says Versace, made in Italy, and my size is, um, I got a size 8, I'm usually a size 7.5, but with socks and stuff, and like, yeah, I, my, my foot is like really wide at the front, so got the 8. Now these don't have um, laces or anything, they just have an elastic here, and um, you just slip them on, and they're super, super, super comfortable. I wore them out the other day for my brother's birthday, and uh, they're really nice to wear. These are um, kangaroo leather, so it's uh, yeah, it's made from kangaroo, and it's super soft and thick. Like you can feel when you, especially when you put your foot in and like you you step on it, you can feel like you can actually feel that it's double because they um, Versace actually double lines the sole of their shoe, so it ends up being super comfortable from the inside, and it's all padded on the like where your toes are up here as well. So that's how the shoes look. Now these, um, price-wise, they were uh, $1,125 Canadian dollars, and with tax, it came up to around $1,300. Um, and they're honestly gonna last forever because the only thing that I would say is my, my brother pointed this out. The only like I think problem that I'll eventually have with it, but I guess this is with all like leather or soft leather, is that. I don't know if you guys can see that right there, but it is it creases where like your where you step, where your toe is, and it also creased a little bit right here. 
Um, that's because when I guess when I packaged it, I left the tongue out, but it's, I sh it should technically be in like this. But yeah, so it is creasing a little bit here. But we asked the guy if like the 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 um, the design will like peel off or flake off or anything, and he said that that will never happen. So I guess. Um, that's the one good thing about it, but I mean, creasing will happen with every shoe. It just bothers me right there. Um, but I, it's not that bad. It's not too bad. Uh, I just took, make sure I take care of it. The bottom sole here, um, it's actually rubber. So I first thought that it would be really, really like hard to clean because you know how like white gets dirty so fast, obviously. But because it's rubber, you can just use... Um, like a, okay, also for the receipt for the shoes, um, they put it in this little booklet and then, I don't know, the guy gave us his card and then it comes with the receipt. So with tax, it came up to 1384 something something. So that is that. Where is the bag? <laughs> well, I wanted a pair of shoes that, cause I'm always in sweats and stuff. Um, I don't really wear uh, I don't really wear jeans or whatever, so I needed a pair of shoes that I could look nice in, um, wearing sweats and uh, I don't know workout clothes. I guess you could say like casual clothing. And these were the ones. There were these. Uh, they had these other ones. I'll put a picture in, <clears throat> and they were kind of like a burnt orange, and it was snakeskin python. No python. I think it was python and it had like scales on it they were so beautiful but they were like i think they were two thousand dollars so i didn't get those because that's just too much for shoes i could justify these but i could not justify those um because that's just a lot of money for shoes so these look really nice with sweatpants i wore them with tights and I haven't worn them with jeans yet, but they'll probably look fine with jeans. And I look like a boss wearing them, cause. And another thing, I think like if you really wanted to beat someone up with them, and you hit them with the Medusa head, it would hurt. That's another nice thing too. So, yeah, that's it. Um, I hope you guys like these shoes, and I will see you in my next video, which will probably be a talking video on some kind of fitness topic so if you guys have any questions let me know down below and make sure to follow me on instagram because i will always be updating you guys on there and that's about it so i'll see you in my next video